Okay, uh, everything, just keep it rolling, everyone. Everyone, cameras, lights, action. Okay, hey everybody, welcome back. I'm putting the headphone on. We're actually gonna do one more episode of this session. Nobody even fucking cares what session it is. Anyway. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. This could I, be months. That's what I just said. So why are you? Hi, this is Jeremy. Jeremy, thanks for coming back. Appreciate it. We know how much you've been wanting to play this. Yeah. I know how much you've said I've wanted to play this, which is way more than I've wanted to play it by, like, a lot. <laughs> Jeremy! Jeremy! Oh, I got the game! Jeremy! Jeremy! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Jeremy! 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 It just says I've been blocked. Listen, just to see that toolbox there, it's worth it, because that's a handsome-looking toolbox. I need one. It, it can open up, and many tools can come out. Many utility items. Whoa, what the fuck? Oh, what? rubber bullets. Oh my god, it's like we're playing Dino Crisis. Cup of coffee. <gasps> I'm alright, I swear. Alright, there's all right, there's already plenty of stuff. We got a Coke? A Coke? Some cigs? Lollipop? Fills your stomach a tiny bit. Aw. He's got a tiny tummy. I don't know too much about guns. Is it possible to load rubber and real bullets into one gun? At the same time, I uh, wouldn't recommend it. But it is possible. I'm assuming so. Gun I'm experts out the there, the since we have, so we at this point possible. when this episode comes out, we have like a thousand subscribers. So, uh, gun owners out there. Yeah, everybody's gonna like that whole goblin jizz box. thing. It's, what else could I would. For? It's great. It's proof. What about the? Well, no, we'll get him with the Medusa sex. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hoping to get it, a Medusa out of it yeah oh we're gonna come into the closet i think medusa would sleep in a closet no i think that medusa would sleep on like this weird marble uh s-shaped couch that is surrounded by a cauldron of fire and big columns and shit all right i mean you didn't have to go so dark i mean just like all Jeez. kinds of... All, what are you talking about? I mean, I just just want to know if she would just stay in the closet and you just had to make it all spooky. And I'm going to shave now. I'm going to shave my yeah. skin off. Yeah, I made it spooky by taking it out of a closet where it's totally not spooky at all. Yeah. I mean, what a... You know what? Speaking of spooky... Due to the that's a great world, shower. I wish I had a fucking shower like that. All over America. Look at all that room. Do you know what I, I know. I have a standing shower, but I definitely don't have this much room. Because my cock is so big. <laughs> like, you could safely do a handstand in that. Oh, have you ever done a handstand BJ? Have you ever gotten a... Uh, let me ask you something. Have you ever gotten a, uh, a BJ while doing a handstand? The shower was invented so that I don't do handstands, Nico. Yeah, but what about back in the day? I never did handstands. That's like a gymnastics move. Yet there are far too many <sighs> All right, in sorry. That have showers in <laughs> weak water. I've always wanted to get a BJ while being in a handstand. I think I might try it tomorrow. It's Why? So on you myself. Can have all, about your this. blood pressure go through the roof and you fucking fall and smash your neck against the ground? I'll probably lose all blood circulation out of my peen, too, because it's going straight to my other head. You'll probably be totally impotent because your blood can't reach your ween because it's all in your fucking skull. Fucking, look, I got, I can make it work if you just give me a chance. Yeah, and your heart will explode because it'll try to fucking regulate your blood pressure. I'll just get like a go- Oh! <laughs> hey there, chef. What's cooking? Uh, that's how it's going to look when I when you look through your peephole, Jeremy. I, I like how he's it. just wearing the tie around his neck. The Doesn't have a Pete. collar. It's casual, you know? Concierge. I just heard from our chef. He's got. Wish to learn the yeah, he's got a nice old white tea. Yes, I've gathered. It's his wife beater underneath. French, but <laughs> he's like uh, he's like a GTA character. Why, yes, sir. Um, you shouldn't say wife beater. That's derogatory just... towards shirts. Especially white shirts. Would you like to know what this one means? You know. Yes, I would. Metallica's watching. I like York's tie though. It looks like he's got a strawberry tie. In French. It's not a cock tie, at least, right? And I've never seen one of those. A cock tie? 
Yes. Yeah, like I've seen ties that look like keyboards or ties that look like fish. It's beautiful. Wait, fish? And Yeah, it just looks like you got a fish hanging on your shirt. It's classy. Now, I don't think I don't know if I believe you. If you ever need anything. Okay, fucking Google fish tie right now. Hold on, there's so much story going on. You're very invested, I can tell. Mmm, gives. Mm. Did you see that, Zach? Mm -hmm. That was clear. Did he just what? Did he just fart out of his mouth? <laughs> twin. He said twin. Twin Peaks reference. Got it. All right, I win. <laughs> We're doing great, Jeremy. We're making great progress. Oh God. Makes the man. Remember, everybody. Jeremy is the David Lynch expert. I'm not a David Lynch expert. I love David Lynch, though. Okay, every, he's. Yeah. Most every movie that he's done and I've seen I have enjoyed can I ask you a I, question I, I done seed I done sawed what do you think this oops the fuck did I where, where did I just go oh is this the inventory what the fuck or the menu that's kind of cool hey, you're in the red room it's like the black lodge all right let me ask you something the red does, room does this painting define who you are does it define your life if you can see it in your tiny window can't really see it can't zoom in either. Is it like a Union soldier? What is that? No, I think it's a guy. No, he's playing a saxophone. Oh, and like flames are coming out of it or something? Nah, it's just... No. I wish I could play the saxophone. You like that instrument? I think... I think... Knowing how to play any one instrument really good would be cool. I don't care what it is. I could I make it work. What, uh, didn't you play drums? No. I was a bass player for a short time. And for a way even shorter time, I was a guitar player. Dozens of paintings oh. no one will ever see. Right now, I just compose on the computer. Tobacco, yeah, you tea, do you, you also T-pose as well on the computer? I learned by fucking programming a drum machine. I had an RY-20 whenever I was a kid. Zach. And I used to fucking create beats and play bass along with him. Yeah. He appears to be a gentleman. Well, all I know, actually, we should talk to him. I learned how to play. I wish I could have been a fucking drummer. That would have been cool. You still can. They're too expensive and they take up too much space and they're loud and it pisses everybody off. Hey, if so they had those fucking uh, uh, MIDI trigger drum kits like they do now, those electric drums. Yeah, uh, electric drums. Totally wouldn't. I, they didn't nice have those time. when I was a kid. Well, they did. They were just did super expensive. It yeah. It's, been a it's long Baron Samdi. He's come here to, no one these uh, guys ever tries to put a cig cigar out in my skull. They can see I think that's something he does. I don't know. To what's in front of him. I don't even know what a, what a, what a Sunday is. It's, it's voodoo <laughs> shit, pretending. man. Who do you voodoo, bitch? That's yeah, what exactly. society does to people. I've been to the Sundry Movie Festival, <laughs> and I saw my favorite movie, The Island. Han Hanuman. Hanu. Zoomed away from what? Hanu. Oh, we're we're doing a Zoom call. I just realized yeah. that. With like a magic mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the sexiest monster of them all? I am. He's got a parasite draped around his shoulders. Don't fucking talk about my favorite hero. <laughs> One of the few Star Wars monsters I liked was like that weird bald guy or girl. I don't know what it was, but it had just like a big white tentacle thing wrapped around its skull. It's weird. Yeah, it's a Twi'lek. You probably have no idea what I'm talking about. Yeah, I do. It's a Twi'lek. Hello. Oh, yeah. Hello. I'm waiting for your reaction. Fell tin maidens in the shrine of hunger. Hello. Hello. The hell happened? What happened? Just the game getting really fucking trippy. No, like, you weren't saying anything. Can you hear me now? And the game glitched, or the game stopped. What? Are we still going? I don't know. You tell me. Nothing stopped on my end except it was just the Discord thing. Got 
fucking oh. stuck, and I couldn't hear you. So if you were saying something to me, I couldn't hear it. That's because I became a part of the painting, Jeremy. Looks like we've all what? taken our first figment of your imagination. Are you the apple? But such is our duty. <laughs> we need to accept the case. Yes, I am. I am. I am lust. I am greed. I am the embodiment of all that is sin. You are the goblin seed. Cuckoo, cuckoo! Do you go out late at night in, into the cemetery and light a big fire and dance around it, going, "I am lust. I am greed. I am made from goblin seed." <laughs> Me and my dad every time, every night on the week. That's sad. Don't fucking judge me, bitch. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking call your house right now, motherfucker. <laughs> you and your dad on a fucking goblin camping trips where you pretend to be goblins in the cemetery. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you fucking yeah, judge me. Yeah, how dare I judge you for doing that? Sorry. That Look, how'd you know my mom left me? Okay, reaction. she left me because of that. First time we did it, my dad and I did that. Yeah, the like, thing's Bye. stuck again. I don't and it's care. A buffalo hunting trophy. Now that's a surprise. I've seen several Hello. trophies made out of human Hello? skin, but never a buffalo. <laughs> Quit pretending yeah. like there's problems. There are problems. Looking at him brings out. Is it still? Is it still messing up? A minute. A minute ago, uh, he was running was and he froze. And he he froze in mid run, and you didn't say anything. I couldn't hear you. It's really scary. The last scene in that you stop freaking me out. Such a sublime, majestic. It's Discord being shitty. It was filled with everything that was oh, we're talking about 2001 Space Odyssey. Space Odyssey. I haven't seen that either. Just I have. About it makes me want to watch it like again. three, three times. It once we get maybe. Well, I can't wait till we watch uh, Fire and Ice. I can't wait till we watch Fire and Ice. Do I sound like that to you? <laughs> you fucking. Fire and ice. You son of a bitch. <laughs> But fucking sound like that. Funny, it's because I do a funny voice and I repeat the things that you just said. Doesn't mean I'm fucking making fun you of fucking, you. You fucking you calling me a you mean, just because you didn't go to goblin dance parties. Look like the city shaped like a big moth. The moth by Ashton Kutcher. The moth effect. Uh, That's the prequel. That, that was one of the movies that uh, Ryan. Uh, suggested Maybe that we watch. Terrible yes, idea. Yes. Why it ended up this way. Uh, he's like, have you seen the butterfly effect? I'm like, yes. Yes, yes unfortunately. Is that really? It's a pretty depressing movie too. It's a fucking boring movie. It's stupid movie. Ew, he's too stupid. You didn't like it when he put a bomb in the mailbox? I didn't like the fat guy with the spiky hair. Ashton Kircher. A childish riddle. <laughs> yeah, he had sex with my daughter. And then he said I got punked, but there was jizz all over the floor. I don't know. I don't know who I to said, believe. Really? That's not my daughter, that's my mom. Exactly <laughs> now, I don't know if I'm lying or not, because Ashton Kircher's jizz is all over my orifice. Yep, totally can't hear you. Perfect. We'll keep going. Hello. Now let's Halo. By tracking down those ten maidens. Hello. Oracle Halo. Place in an act. We need to go to the Shrine of Hunger. Halo. Yeah. Now where in this yeah, town to... can one satiate their hunger? <laughs> the it's all right. We're we'll get through it. We got. We got about like seven minutes, baby. We got it's this, baby. It's not me. It's a Discord. I know. Discord sucks. The answer is bowling. The shape of the bowling pin was based on the feminine form. Mer, the ten I'm being called a the ten bowling pins. pin because of my feminine stature. But a place where someone can both eat by who? And bowl at the by same Francis time. York Patty. I'm skeptical as to. He's saying that about you. Such a place in a yeah. Like Sounds this. like he's starting to sound like you now when you talk shit about my dad and I goblin camping trips. You know. I wasn't talking shit. I just so judged you for it. No, it's time to get it's fine. Already know the now let's it. start by tracking down those ten maidens. The I, uh, gave us a place and an ass. Look, I just didn't really know my dad, okay? <laughs> it's just my way of dealing with things. Is that you saying that? <laughs> my dad never... My mom and dad, they never took me to Goblin 
It's the way I, I'm just externalizing pain. The bowling pin was based on the feminine form. The ten maidens are the ten... Like, you'd be just so upset that your parents didn't take you to, uh, camping. Dance like a goblin? <laughs> yeah, it's like a goblin at a camping trip. Yeah, my dad never did anything with me. Sucks! Oh, man, I wanted to play the, play the slave drum. I wanted a big torch to wave around. And it goes... To wear the leopard skin across my loins. <laughs> that sounds too happy for goblin music. The ten maidens are the ten pins. What was that goblin song you were chanting a minute ago? Hey, how are ya? Hey, how are ya? <laughs> <laughs> no, you know, like something about being born of goblin seed? That was you seeing that. No, you said it. You came up with the lyrics. Oh, God, I forget. Oh, who cares? It sucked. <laughs> no, it was great. It'll go down. And our goblin seed. It was The final line was like something. I feel my goblin seed. I can't. I don't remember the first two lines. It was a very short and sweet goblin seed song. Nice job, Zach. I knew you'd be able to. By the way, we're going to the bowling alley. We gotta look for the Ten Maidens. I want to be really good at the saxophone the so I can play in the goblin band. Did you know uh, Steve Harris played in a goblin band, and he was and he was uh, still he was the bassist in that one as well. There's no flying serpent on this. <laughs> okay, what was the name of the goblin band he was in? Um, be a contrail or perhaps a dragon. Uh, First. That was it. Out where we okay, need great. Do you know what the ambiguous yeah, Okay, so yeah, it was uh zero is usually treated as a uh, base number. <laughs> but under what conditions would a base All right. number be ambiguous? Hey everybody, we're uh thanks for coming out. We're the band temperature. Uh, what? Yes. Uh, zero degrees Fahrenheit. You just cut out again. I don't give a fuck. Degrees Celsius and zero degrees It's hard to pay attention to anything. Fahrenheit. You'd be hard pressed to find a more ambiguous zero than that. Let me tell you something. The question is, does our zero what? refer to Celsius? Welcome to our show. We're the band. Uh, which measurement uh, system do we use here in America? Thanks for. We're gonna play our first song called. Hi hi. I'm here, not playing the fucking song. Here we here we go, and it goes. Goblin C, Goblin C. Everyone will succeed. Very funny, now, Something about already know the, do you know taking the things from people in need. What were the lyrics? Taking things from people in need. Goblin C, Goblin C, taking things from people that are in need. Goblin C, Goblin C. That's not how the song went. I think your timing is a little off. We gotta like, it'll be a progressive song. That's okay. It's fucking terrible. Yeah, I'm singing the uh, Under the Sea from Little Mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> don't you yeah, that, yeah, I know. <laughs> don't you hate your life even more? I don't know. I just think of Sora. Didn't he have, like, Patrick Stars over his nipples or something? And how about that? Are you talking about Kingdom Hearts? Yeah. His oracles may end up that, that series heart. sucks. Let's not talk about it. <laughs> no, let's talk about it forever now. <laughs> Donald Goofy. <laughs> Gorsh. <laughs> Did you just make Donald oh, Duck sound like a cobra? This is a <laughs> <laughs> wow, no, I'm making him sound like the white noise that he is. <laughs> No smoking in the lobby, Jeremy. I try to do my Donald Duck, but I don't have my fucking uh, Are you pop filter friends with the in front of my microphone. Who fucking cares? I'm gonna mute I don't it wanna anyway. I don't want to spit all over my microphone. Place, yeah. I'm gonna mute all of our fucking dialogue. We're just gonna hear the game. Why? If you want to just play the game to enjoy the game, then play the game. No, I'm just gonna mute the game. It's just gonna be dialogue. We've struck gold here, Zach. What? It just screams. Hi, how are you? South. Actually, no. Where? This is I don't know. Did you look up? So, if I want to smoke, I should he go out the charmed. entrance and around to the rear parking lot. <laughs> bada bing, bada boom. Bingo, bango. Okay. 
Now it's playing like kind of like uppity jazz where it's like, <laughs> oh man, you're unbelievable. That type of vibe. That's not, EMF was not jazz. What? Uh, no, just, no, no. Sleepy Joe, no. <laughs> oh shit. I'm so, I'm ready to fucking call it a night. That's, that's what our guy's saying. Man, I gotta call it a night. Why is he run like a goof? That's creepy. Can you imagine? Jeremy, are you still there? He's really pushing hard off his calves. Okay, oh. I, I thought I lost you. Can you just imagine you you're just sitting sure there? Make sure he gets full foot extension. Ooh, look at that look straight that kick. That jab. Come on. See, he knows what's up. Dang, all right. Bend the knees, bend the knees. Touch my goblin seed, touch my goblin seed. Shit, shit! Oh, the weather outside is frightful. Frankenstein became Dracula. See that poster? Of course he didn't. It's fine. That's actually kind of a cool movie premise. Like if Frankenstein turned into a vampire. By Boris Bowles. Ah, I dig it. By a Boris Bowles? By a Boris Bowles. All right. On the takeaway of this episode, we learn nothing. Just kidding, that's a lie. But I'm gonna punch somebody in the face as we end the episode. Don't worry, I saved, folks. Everything is fine. Nobody is actually going to get harmed. <laughs> it got a really good person to punch then. All right, fine. Who, who looks like they're up to no good up in this town here? Punch the person that you think is the most important person in the room. Okay, let's talk to David Lynch right here. Actually, no, this is uh, Michael Rooker. He's <laughs> about to sell you gravy. I just got to find $100. Did he make any noise? No, nothing's happening. I'm just, my, my money's being deducted. Well, maybe stop doing it then, I guess. The, the government's taking my tax money. They're taxing me. All right, now we're down to zero. I like the weird Tekken lightning explosion that happens when you kick him. <laughs> All right, everybody. So we learned that Michael Rooker is a man. He can take he can take a hit. You should turn into Devil York and hit him with your flying eye beam. How about I just kiss him? Oh, right here. Oh, this is good. I, I missed you so much. Let's run away together and never return. I'll have to sell the lamp store. <laughs> no, no. Why are you? Why are you no. still being fine? No, we. <laughs> we're I can't read the text. Because we're selling the lamps. Because we're selling the lamp store at a loss. No, really. Because <laughs> I punched him so many times. Oh, oh it just hasn't caught up yet. Okay. <laughs> Okay, guys, we're ready to go now. This has been Let's Plop. I'm gonna fucking drink my goblin cum now. That's terrible. You know, my my dad told me about goblin cum um, physiology. <laughs> yeah. Let's, let's just say that uh, that I was never the same after that. Still, how are me you different? And you just have to find out on the next on the next. On the next, on the next, on the next.